Previously on Total Bragging Rights. Courtney Whip Morgan in the Whipped Cream bonus round and is back on top by 100 points. Two events remaining. Who will win this episode of Total Bragging Rights? Makeup Challenge rules. Whoever puts on their makeup the best in five minutes wins. Makeup, 500. Makeup, 100. Next is makeup, and uh, I got a younger sister and older sister. I'm the only brother, so I think I can do this. It's going to be a close call, but uh, makeup is not my specialty either. Don't get me wrong. But I know a be uh, beautiful lady when I see one. We are doing our makeup challenge, so we have to do a daytime face in five minutes. That's the challenge. We have gone through and made sure we have all the same product. So we're gonna do foundation, concealer, powder, eyeshadow, blush, mascara, eyeliner, and we're not doing eyebrow. And of course we all have the same tools to use as well. So we all have our brushes here. So everything is even, Steven, and it should be fair. They said they're gonna do it in five minutes. I'm quoting 20. I wish any girl could do it in five minutes. The event that I wanted to double down on. Double down. double down rules. Both contestants have one double down. They may use their double down before any challenge. And if they win, their bid is doubled. But if they lose, their opponent's bid is doubled. One, two. So I'm gonna look at the eye, eye makeup, um, how darkness is, how dark it is, because you don't want it too dark, because like she said, it's daytime, and she's not going out to the club. Um, also, the cheeks can't be too rosy, but they can also have a little bit of rosy because it's during the day, so they're gonna be a little hot, they a little flushes. Um, they didn't do their lips, so we don't have to worry about that. But then at the end, it's gonna be overall. Courtney and Morgan out of the eyes. So I can see your eyes on the side. I can't even tell what color you got. I would say Courtney on the eyes. I would say Morgan on the bl blush or cheeks. And then overall. in a coffin <laughs> <laughs> but oh, this is a tough call this is the hardest one I've ever had for so far you put me on the spot I didn't know I was gonna have to what's up okay um 
And don't pity anybody. I'm not pitying nobody. Dude, this is hard. <laughs> I would Thanks have to go with way. the tiebreaker, and that'd be have to be the difference from not wearing any makeup, from being sporty to just straight daytime, and Morgan's the winner of that, so she won. Oh, that's a bunch of BS. Winner, Morgan. <laughs> well, Courtney's giving me shit over here. I have to admit, even Houston, the ref, commented on her eyes. And she always helps me out with my eyes whenever we're getting ready for an event or a shoot. So I give her props for that. But um, I do have experience with daytime makeup because I don't wear very much. So I don't know, maybe that's where it came in. Um, well, yeah, I think it's bull. bull. I'm calling it. All right, all right, we'll show sportsmanship. It's hard, we both do the whole modeling thing. Yes, I do tend to put my makeup on a little heavier since um, that's how I'm used to it. So that could have been my fault today. It was extremely difficult. They're both very, very pretty ladies. And I felt bad choosing one over the other either way. Um, but it was definitely close, no matter if they had makeup on or not. Favorite moment. What have we had? You know, when we were in San Francisco at that photo shoot, that was pretty awesome. That was fun. That was pretty awesome. We had, um, we did a calendar, and we had to go to Treasure Island to do a signing for this calendar, and afterwards, we ended up meeting some of her friends in San Francisco, and they were so nice, and they ended up inviting us to their friend's house for like a housewarming slash birthday party. And it was the best time that we've summertime. had together. I mean, like, it, I think it took our friendship to like the next level because we had never been in the zone where we could just like relax and really have fun together. It's always been more working. Yeah. Um, experiences and so after we did that one signing in Treasure Island um, I was fortunate enough to be invited over with some great friends from San Francisco and we we just had a good time all night long with them they were so, so much, much fun, fun. <laughs> they were so nice and then we were I off I could remember all their names I would totally list them off right now oh well but they were all so nice and David invited us into their home and like it was nothing I mean we were total strangers and we walked in and oh hey how you doing yeah you know kiss on the cheek and they're so like from Spanish. yeah they're from Spain and France and so they're just all loving and kind and and yeah, here, you want something to drink, you want some food? Yeah, and, and then and we, we kept at it all night because after that we were off to San Jose. Yeah. And it was the drives too, the drives were really fun, oh just God. laughing and <laughs> being silly. I need a car camera. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of the posters that I did for um, the photo shoot that we had the calendar signing for at Treasure Island. Um, we did it for SB Freaks, which is a bike company. Um, a bike group out of San Francisco, and it was a support the troops calendar that they were doing. So all their proceeds went to supporting the troops. Um, obviously, this is one. It says I'd give the clothes off my back to our troops, and I am doing just that. So. <laughs> <laughs> this is part of the calendar shoot that we did um, for the SB Freaks, and they are a bike crew out of San Francisco, and we had a lot of fun. Um, this is um, when we had a memorable time going to San Francisco and hanging out with our friends afterwards, but this was a shoot that we did together and we had the calendar signing for it in Treasure Island. And Renee Vang is the photographer. She's down in LA oh, yes. now. Um, you can get her on our Facebook too. And for mine as well. She's a photographer on both of the photos. Yeah, and this so picture... Awesome job. This picture is on my Facebook as well. Next time on Total Bragging Rights, the two friends do Morgan Swimming Challenge. One event remains. <laughs> Tune in next week to find out who won this episode of Total Bragging Rights. Who do you think is going to win? Comment below. Thank you for watching Total Bragging Rights. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to tell your friends.
but it's awesome when friends can get together and just have a good competition.